The Man with the Trumpet by Sherwood Anderson Read by Frank Blissett I stated it as definitely as I could. I was in a room with them. They had tongues like me and hair and eyes. I got up out of my chair and said it as definitely as I could. Their eyes wavered. Something slipped out of their grasp. Had I been white and strong and young enough, I might have plunged through walls, gone outward into nights and days, gone into prairies, into distances, gone outward to the doorstep of the house of God, gone to God's throne room with their hands in mine. What I am trying to say is this. By God I made their minds flee out of them. Their minds came out of them as clear and straight as anything could be. I said they might build temples to their lives. I threw my words at faces floating in a street. I threw my words like stones, like building stones. I scattered words in alleyways like seeds. I crept at night and threw my words in empty rooms of houses in a street. I said that life was life, that men in streets and cities might build temples to their souls. I whispered words at night into a telephone. I told my people life was sweet, that men might live. I said a million temples might be built, that doorsteps might be cleansed. At their fleeing, harried minds I hurled a stone. I said they might build temples to themselves. That was The Man with the Trumpet by Sherwood Anderson Read by Frank Blissett